Hello, dorks, dork heads, and everyone in between, and welcome to tonight's episode of Dungeons and Dork Heads, with the conclusion of Fog of Kellingville. Welcome back, everybody. Also known as Silent Hill. It's good to have you guys here. Received a lot of good feedback on the, uh... On the last episode, so that's pretty good. Pretty good. The last, did the last episode release yet? Yes. Yeah, I oh, saw me. it. I saw it on YouTube. I was like, oh, hey, there it is. Pretty. It, yeah. Got a lot of got a lot of positive feedback on that. So, really happy about that. I am gonna put this cough drop in my mouth. Would anyone like to say anything uh, while we're while I'm doing that? <laughs> I'm gonna put this sandwich in my mouth. Quick thing. Hopefully there'll be no more pastries. Quick thing. Throat is a bit scratchy. I have been fighting off a cold. I can't promise the voices are gonna be great for this. Ah, who cares? I also rip me. Like. Hmm? Dante would have loved to have pastries made of people. <laughs> I believe we went over this in uh, Conversation Castle. They are all hexed. It doesn't give, don't give a shit. Eating them anyway. It'll be like, put me in a room so if I have a bad trip, I'll be fine. Which reminds me, <laughs> I gotta upload Conversation Castle. Everybody remind me to do that. Hey, Hunter, upload Conversation Castle. I will yeah. do that, but first, we have to finish Fog of Kellingville. So, where we left off, our band of adventurers were on their way back to the Adventure Guild. Year is 872 post fracture, and stuff's going down over at the Guild. Letter came. Very important matter. On their way, they ended up in a small town called Kellingville. Wandered around here for a spell. Got to meet the locals. And a very delightful baker. Who it turns yeah. out was a who it turns out was an evil witch. A hag, if you're looking for specifics. This hag Turns out was chopping up people and turning them into pastries. And I will apologize because we were supposed to do a joke with the little girl last week where she was going to be like, It's people! <laughs> Soiling I mean, green joke. People. And the party, realizing this, promptly said, Oh, well, we can't have that now, can we? And they stormed the bakery to fight her. And, uh, didn't end too well. <laughs> uh, one of our party members smacked the other party member in the face. Good time. Sorry. <laughs> that was, you were the one who got smacked. What are you apologizing for? Oh, wait, oh, crap, you're right. Yeah, I remember. Oh, yeah, I got hit in the face. <laughs> <laughs> he got hit so hard, he doesn't remember who did it. <laughs> he know what happened. He hit somebody else. But one oh, of the I'm so party sorry I hit you. I hit you. <laughs> one of the party members, however, was mocked viciously. Yes. By the way, I have more prepared. <laughs> so, they stormed the windmill where they met a cat, which was unimportant. Uh, and then they went into the hag lair. Where they met a small girl who tasked them with finding her mother deeper inside the mines. As the party ventured inside, they met Tart, who they promptly destroyed. <laughs> like, um, oh, you guys coming. destroyed her. <laughs> uh, we weren't letting that shit slide. You, you, you said it was a coven. On... We're fucking up the coven. <laughs> Happy and Dusk doubled down on Toll the Dead and freaking yep. Sonic damaged her to death. And that's yep, where we left off. So, 
Adventurers, what do you wish to do? Well, let's see. Well, I mean, if we're going down this way, we have two paths we can go down. I see a path down this way, and I see a little one this way. Where would be the most likely area to go to to find to find this bitch? Probably this way. Probably. Wait, there's more stuff, stuff that right way? Than... I just mean, I see there's a way down this way, and there's a little way down this way. No, there isn't. Uh, you look down this way, and the cave kind of just ends, and it looks yeah, like it, I figured. it looks like it goes deeper, but that part is underwater. This is clearly where the sea hag was basically hanging out. Hanging it up. If you wish to word it that way, then yes. Yeah. Oh, there is more stuff over here. Ah, uh, we didn't go over here. I see a bright light. I think that's a torch. There is indeed a bright oh. light. So is there... I Do you wish to go towards it? Mm, do we go towards the light? That, see, that seems ominous. But we could. Oh. I can't tell if these all go to the same place or not. After you, big boy. Woo! Yes. What's going up in here? So you yeet yourself okay. down the hall? Yep. All right. Uh, we, we, let me check for traps. Yeah, I was about to ask. Yeet. Okay. I stopped make, there. Make an investigation that, check. Okay, my plus zero investigation check. Let's go. Normal. The most middle of the road investigation check ever. Three dusk. Oh my god! The most observant dusk member of the party. Smart. Very smart man. All right, so yeah, dusk. You make a thorough examination of the surrounding areas. You do find a trip wire, but it doesn't look like it's hooked up to anything. Hmm. Hmm. It's almost like they were beginning to set this trap, but didn't finish it. Oh, I guess they know we're here then. Well, they've been because... around, you know? Yeah. Gotta double down. Be careful, you know? Where's this tripwire? Oh, it's like from here to here. This, What you can see here, it looks like something of a destroyed barricade. For some I reason. I stopped right at the barricade. It does look old, but doesn't look hag related. This seems to have hmm. been here a while. Probably a part of the original mine. Well, yeah, most likely they just kind of procured. Perhaps set it. up to keep out hags. Mm. Looking a bit deeper in, you I mean, can see maybe. what looks, looks like over here is a it. destroyed brazier, probably for mine lighting, which has long since gone out, and that is why. It's very dark in this tunnel. Yeah, it's a little dork. That's okay. We're just gonna gingerly step over that wire, just in case. Eh. Make an athletics Horse check. Jumps over the wire. <laughs> athletics to step over a wire for fun. All right. <laughs> All right. Well. I'm proficient. I guess I also have to do an athletics no, check. No, no, this is just for fun. Yeah, you're fine. You <laughs> say I'm proficient. I have that for me. Cork high fives, Boulder. As you look yeah. at it, you, as you look at it, you, it looks more like this is less of a trap. It looks like this is just a trip wire. This is just something that you're gonna trip over, and they're gonna be all like, ha ha. <laughs> I mean, they just didn't set up the trap part, so now it's just a, like, haha -ha trip, dude. <laughs> I may not be smart, but I don't want to be an embarrassment. At least not completely. Hey, so what are you doing? I'm trying to look down the, the hallway more. Well, I kind of want to go over there. i creeping along. Okay. want a Perseppi for anything. 
I need to know, is there anything questionable, Abu? From what you can see with your dark vision, looks like a tunnel. Well, it doesn't seem like there's anything dangerous. Broken pickaxe okay. over here. What the hell is this? Uh, you, from what you can see, it looks like another destroyed brazier, but different. Yeah, I didn't zoom in enough. Just it looked like copy, a. Copy, you coming? Yep, we're nah, coming. They'll, they'll come eventually. <laughs> What's going on over here? Right, so, so you reach the end there. of the long tunnel and you realize that the source of the light is a jack-o'-lantern. Because this was supposed to be the Halloween episode. But I didn't I didn't know Hag celebrated Halloween. But looking around this room, you also realize there's a lot of stuff in here. Mm-hmm. It's a dead end with a lot of stuff. Is this just like... I assume this is a chest. Yeah, it looks like it. Poppy, activate gremlin powers. What? What do you mean? There's a chest There's right a chest there. Right There's right stuff here. everywhere. Hey, are you just assuming that I can break into this chest? I don't I even mean... know if it needs to be broken into. Yeah. Uh, I'm just saying, you're the one that has the power to just gremlin anything. Hey, that's that's racist. Anyway, no, not. Uh, we're just going off of your skills previously. Not I, talking about I, race I can't or anything of the sort. Only back. Uh, so Dusk is gonna quick check the chest for traps. Okay, roll investigation. Looks safe. Unnatural twenty. All right. Pappy's gonna see if it's locked. It is locked, but it's a very jiggly lock. Uh, and Pappy's gonna give it the uh, full one two hello and uh, rip the chest open. I was going uh, to say, want me okay, to make, it? A, make a strength check. All right, ability check, roll. Only an 11. Surprisingly, that does not get it open. Do you want me to Let me check. It? I can do this. Team Great. building exercise. Both of you go. Strength check. Uh, I guess I just click strength. Yes, ability check. Normal. You got this. 21. Does the 21 open it? <laughs> Alright, yeah. You look at it. You see the lock. And you just take your fist and you... Cut down on top of the lid like Kratos from God of War. Shatters the lid open. What do I get out of it? There is a rather nice cloak in there, actually. Hmm. Um. What is it? What is it? What is can it? someone investigate this cloak before I put it on? I don't want it to actually be, you know, bad. What, you think it might be magical or something? Could be Hex too. I, I think so, yes. Alright, well, you're looking at the wrong person. Uh, I was talking about Dusk. Or... I am very paranoid about it. <laughs> uh, Dusk will... Should, should Dusk make, like, an Arcana check to see if it's a magical cloak? Because I, I don't think either of us have Detect Magic. You can do so. I'm, I I don't know what that I I think it I don't know I think it's dangerous I don't trust it. Dusk looks at it and shrugs. <laughs> it does feel magicish. Maybe a little bit. It's probably oh boy, I'm gonna use is. my zero time check. Here is we go. <laughs> Fourteen. All right, getting a second opinion here. Yeah. Magic-ish. I don't trust it! <laughs> Seems you can harm put it on? It, it does it. seem harmless, though. I'll put the cloak in my inventory. How about that? Okay. Uh, I don't know if this cloak has a name. I may just have to put cloak. <laughs> in loose. It's cloak. Yeah, I mean, just put it on. Put What's the worst that'll happen? 
I mean, if it seems harmless, I don't trust it, but you know. Science? Do Put it on. To, do you wish Put to put the cloak on? Put it on. Peer sure, pressure. why not? Peer pressure. I put on the cloak. Uh, I'm gonna throw you a bone here. Make an investigation check for me. Okay. So I sound trap then. Uh, normal, I guess. Wow, I got 16. That's not bad. Oh, uh, that is not bad. So you put you put the cloak on and uh, you give it a little little flip, and at that moment it begins to bellow. It is oh, at this dear. moment you realize this is a cloak of bellowing. Cloak of bellowing. The fuck? That's not on this list. I have to actually impl I have to type it in myself. Great. But why does it do? Why it do the thing it do? Okay. For fun. I'm confused. And I will. Just Put link Hold that in piece. dungeon of roleplay for you all. But how are we gonna sneak if it is bellowing? Anyway, uh, anything else in this room? What is the other stuff in this room? Uh, make what an investigation check. What is all this? One sec, I can't get my thing to open. There we go. I can't investigate. I'm very dumb. It's a low DC. A lot of this stuff is out in the open. Some of the stuff that stands out to you include, but is not limited to, seven healing potions, all nicely arranged upright over here. Uh, there's a long sword over here. There is a rather nice pickaxe over here. In fact, this over here is rather interesting because every other pickaxe on the rack looks like it's been here for decades. But this one, it's either magic or clearly well taken care of. There is also a loot, which looks fairly new, and this net, which you just found. Oh no. I just found. <laughs> hey guys, there's a shit ton of healer potions. Whichever of you needs them, take them. Uh, well, I don't have any. I mean, we're, we're literally clerics, so. I mean, you're right. I'll take two. For, the, two for, 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 for if you guys aren't close enough. It's okay. We'll just we'll just we'll have these these. Or when the clerics need to heal themselves. What if you run out of spells? That'll also, why day. does that pickaxe look so nice? Probably because it's magical. Why is everything magic? Be be because this is a fantasy world. What? What do you mean? It's a lot of magical shit around. But you know, that's the world we live in. Wait, I'm confused. What's confusing about it? There's magic, there's gods. Boulder is convinced he's in a simulation. <laughs> <laughs> His paranoia is not going well. <laughs> For... <laughs> it turns out he got even more paranoid. For... <laughs> For a split second, you start thinking that you're in some kind of simulated world. And then your brain snaps back to reality. And you're like, oh, there goes gravity. Oh, there what goes the gravity. Is... <laughs> what the fuck is a simulation? <laughs> well, that's that's one of those eighth level spells. Makes a what? second version of yourself. Whack. I'm uh, gonna. I'm. I, I gotta know. I pick up the pickaxe. It is also around this time your bless wears off. I'm no longer really? blessed. But I grabbed the pickaxe. I used to still I have questions. All right. You pick it up. You touch it. You stretch it. Seems pretty strong, actually. How do I... What? <laughs> That's even a lot I was going to say, do you mean the oh, poker? Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. 
There, there is a, indeed a weapon in the game called the War Pick. Okay. This is not a War Pick. But did you say I stretched it? Well, you tried. You, ga you gave the stretch what? You gave the handle a little bit of a stretch. A little bit of a bend. <laughs> that be, that be, oh, gotcha. So you mean a bend, not a stretch? A little I'm bit like, of a bend, a little bit of a rubber? stretch. Uh, you you flip it around a little bit. It actually looks like a fairly strong pickaxe. Nice. Yeah, you can probably get uh, 1d6 plus 2 off on enemies with this. I'm going to hold on to this. Maybe I can throw it at something. It does That's feel... a strange metric of uh, wound to apply to someone. You'd well, I'm metagaming, you know. so... <laughs> <laughs> I know. But um, I'll hold on to this. I could probably throw it at something. Looking around the room still, there's not too much else that looks fairly interesting. There's like a bookcase over here with... Uh, some dusty old books. There's a copy of War and Peace on there. Naturally, it has never been read. Um, there's this old, decrepit, magic-looking staff, which uh, it, it looks like it's on the brink of just snapping in half, and this rusted sword over here, and various tools. There's a bucket. The only thing I trust in here is that bucket. And the jack-o'-lantern. I like it. Roll the bucket. Just staring at the bucket. the bucket. Seduce bucket. Impress the bucket. <laughs> Can I impress the bucket with a loot blade? Um, I play, play the loot to impress the bucket. Make a performance check with disadvantage because it is a bucket. But bucket. Are you proficient in seducing buckets? No. Not <laughs> terrible, all things considered. It's a bucket. Not as bad. <laughs> yep, that's a bucket. I tried. Bucket is unimpressed. I'm out of here. I show off my athletics to the bucket. Just backflip. <laughs> I roll for- I'm rolling the check for my F- wait, is this still a disadvantage? What are you rolling for? Athletics, I'm here to impress the bucket. Uh... Yes, with disadvantage let's, because it's a bucket. Let's both do a backflip. Wow! We got a really good roll! <laughs> here, let me try to ba backflip with you, let's see how bad I do. <laughs> Not the I worst. Mean... <laughs> It's a bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I gotta, 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 you know, loosen up a little bit. Helps my paranoia. Anyways, I don't think this leads to where the hag is. It's we, at we this probably... moment that the light goes out. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> and somewhere off in the distance, you can hear just the, just the faintest cackle. It's like... <laughs> You some bitch! Boulder just starts charging backwards. Alright, you do so. Guys, we gotta get her. She took the kids! Well, and the adventuring guild, but she took the kids! Alright, what does the party wish to do? Dark as fuck! Go back to the light, we came. It's okay. dark. Where is this bitch? You head back towards uh, the more well-lit areas of the mine. Uh, would Pappy and Dusk like to join the rest of the party? Yep. They're making their way. Okay, so we gotta go the other way. Yeah, we gotta go up. All right, okay, so you hard. are going up. Let's go home, oh. skillets. <laughs> That's a lot of, that's a lot of bones. So the fresher corpses are closer to the entrance, and it looks like there's mainly skeletons back here. These are m well used, I can... Can I do an investigation check on the um, hallway ahead? Sure. Okay. Uh... 
Damn. Aren't these all adventures killed? The most people? average roll ever. <laughs> Not really. Uh, yeah, the it's spooky, scary. Skeletons. Good skeletons. <laughs> Cork begins to dance. And there is a shiver down your spine. Oh no. Da -da. I want to I want to proceed. Oh, this isn't in the festive <laughs> mood. <laughs> Never mind. Boulder, no! Uh Boulder, I tried can you roll to see <laughs> Boulder, can I tried you roll to see another D twenty for me? I just wanted to see if I could see any like hags creeping. Boulder, uh, where did you get that blindfold? Okay, you you're fine. <laughs> Yep. Well, I don't see any hags, I guess. Y'all don't, know. don't get uh, more scared than you already are. <laughs> Paradise. But I mean, these just look like they were already used up for their meat for them goddamn pastries. I'm gonna mm. creep my way forward. Right. So uh, you get up. You you get you get there, and uh, then from from your right. Uh, you look over to the wall, and right here, you see the skeleton starting to move, and he starts, it, it starts making all the clacky skeleton noises, and he looks at you. Is it, is it oh no, noise? you already died, you stay that way. <laughs> Just pointing at it. You already died, you stay that way, it's not right. Dip, go, sleep. Go back. He stays. Imagine being able to die. I want to. This. I want to intimidate the skeleton. <laughs> no, okay. stay there. Stay there. <laughs> no, I'm not check. dealing with this today. Stay down. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I'm intimidating the skeleton then. Weird. <sighs> Twenty. <laughs> wow, that skeleton's a What he now. said. Stay down. <laughs> They kind of cancel each other out. <laughs> Skeleton stares at you silently for a couple of seconds. I have a joke for you. Oh, no. What is a skeleton's favorite snack? I... Have you already? Go Have on, guess. You can't even eat. Is it people? Come on, guess! Is it pastries? Come on! Ice cream. I'm kidding, man. As you're, you alone? as you're attempting to guess a skeleton's favorite snack, three more kind of stand up at the end of the hallway. And this one, son of a oh, bitch. and this one over here points at you and says, I've got a bone to pick with you! <laughs> no, 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 you oh, motherfuckers need to funny. stay down. I need everyone to roll initiative. <laughs> These motherfuckers need to stay down, they're dead. Stay that way. <laughs> this is why I don't uh, like so... necromancy. Okay, new encounter. Do I admit? Oh, right. You didn't do the new encounter, so we didn't go through. I mean, to retry that. <laughs> a two! A <laughs> one! At least it wasn't a one. At least I don't skip my turn. That's the one good thing about it. You too. Alright, uh, gonna go ahead and. Actually, wait, hang on. I'm gonna. Ignore this one. Ignoring. Okay, good. And I love the party of Shane, Steve, Steve 2, and new actor. Yeah. <laughs> Roll the NPCs. Uh, okay, we're gonna have... Uh... Okay, I'll go with the... Wait, which one is that? That's this guy, okay. Uh, okay, so, top of the round, uh, this guy in the back, let me see what he's got. Uh, he is gonna... Oh, we both rolled, it's funny. Alright, so, he is aiming at, uh, the one in front, that is you, Boulder. And he's gonna take a short bow oh. and, uh... Since, uh... 
Oh, actually, no. All right. That's gonna nice be nine try, to hit. Guy. Okay. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, look nice. at that arrow go. Away. It goes right over my head. And he's gonna move back here behind the pillar. Get back here, you pussy. As, as archers typically do. Uh, okay, Boulder, you're up. Okay, time to wait. Gotta, gotta check what holds the number. Okay, good. I'm gonna get mad. Okay, I'm rage. you rage. Yes. And then it should be. Yeah, it's not that far. Yeah, he's like right there. Give me him for me. I'm gonna go run up to this motherfucker and Hulk smash. Okay. Make make your attack. Where's my thing? There's my thing. And oh wait, what what is the damn plus? Cause I couldn't put that into my thing. I'm trying to remember. <laughs> oh no, it's a damage roll. Okay. Got it. Fourteen. Not yeah, that hits. Go ahead and roll damage. I mean, uh, do, do you expect a skeleton to have defense? <laughs> hey, if it has armor on Their DC armor. is higher That's than true. I thought it would be. Okay. <laughs> uh, this number plus two. Okay, so three. Uh, three. <laughs> three points of damage. Motherfucker. Wait, don't I... Oh, yeah, Whack! I you, run, you run up I have skeleton. extra attack. <laughs> Okay, make, make your uh, second attack. Is extra attack a bonus action? I don't remember. Uh, You're level six, right? Yeah. No, I'm attack. pretty sure it's just uh, also your action. Yeah, that's what I thought. I could remember. Nine, unfortunately, funny. does not hit. So you go in I for the first strike, and you, you manage to crack a couple of ribs in there. But uh, he kind of ducks back and uh, avoids the second strike. You're supposed to stay dead! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> and he nears at you. Rude. Yep, that's my turn. Okay. Uh... So that is your turn, Pappy. And Pappy uh, looks at this skeleton on the wall and is like, "All right, so what's the other part of the joke?" <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, you'll have to give me a second because I, 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 I was expecting this to be like. I mean, snack. What is my favorite snack? <laughs> I, I, like, a skeleton's favorite snack or your favorite snack in particular? What is Obviously a skeleton's favorite cannibal. snack? Uh. God hmm. of gods, this isn't hard! I don't know, ribs? He just shakes his head at you. <laughs> <laughs> Bone the meal! The <laughs> Bone meal! He's just sitting there like I've been waiting until that joke for so long. Uh... Cork, wait your turn. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, Pappy, what are you doing? Uh, Pappy's just gonna stay here and uh, w wait for the answer to this quote joke. <laughs> I must know. Uh, okay. Uh, the situation's then, handled by the rest of the party. Then that is your turn. Uh, <laughs> yep. It is this fella's turn, and he is gonna. Sidestep you a little bit. And I believe you get an attack of opportunity is, anyway. Yeah, that's an attack of opportunity. Yeah. 
Hammering it. Uh, 16 hits. Go ahead and roll damage. It's a nine. Nine points of damage. Motherfucker, no. Okay, so yeah, you swing wide at him, like trying to focus on the other, on the other two in front of you, but it embeds itself in the bone and like nearly severs the spine. And he is not looking good. Anyway, it gets away from you. Unfortunately, he is not dead. He gets here and Cork. He is gonna attempt to hit you with his short sword. Uh, no, not even close. That definitely didn't hit. And just for funsies, I better give him an extra attack. Still didn't hit. Uh, okay, so he runs up to you. He's like, "I'll get you!" And it 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 clinks off your armor. But <laughs> wow, I'm not even. Impressed. I'm impressed how sad that was. It's my first day! <laughs> hey. Go try harder! <laughs> Alright, so that's his turn. Um, moving on to... Uh, who is this? Oh, it's uh, this guy's turn. Uh, he's going to use his free action. Yes! That was his turn. Uh, now it's... Uh, this guy up the front here. And, uh, yeah. Boulder, he's gonna take a whack at ya. Does a 12 nice hit you? No. Uh, okay. Another. Does a 17 Ooh, hit you? Nope. This is not a good day for these skeletons. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> not with a barb around. <laughs> All right, well that was his turn. Uh, Dusk. Nice try, motherfucker. All right, Dusk. Uh, uh, Dusk. Dusk coming up to the plate. Cork, you're on deck. So uh, Dusk is gonna just kind of walk forward and gonna go ahead. Where did Dusk's? Hang on. Can Pappy spare the dying on the skeleton? <laughs> as great as that would be. Uh, so, uh, Dustin is going to uh, walk into the middle of the room and just flip off the skeleton and uh, channel divinity, turn undead, which, because I am uh, above fifth level, uh, any undead of half level or lower automatically gets destroyed if they fail the DC wisdom say 14. So who are you doing this on? It's an AoE. How Every big? 30 feet. Okay, I'm gonna need uh... that oh god. Okay, oh so god. it's pretty much everyone oh in the fucking room. Yep, yeah. that was the point of moving in. Uh, okay. So that was there wisdom save? Wisdom yeah. save 14. Uh, that's not good. They are not wise. Uh, that one survived! Su surprisingly, oh, yes. No. The archer Wait. lives. Nope. Uh... <laughs> Cork, the one in front of you uh, collapses to the ground. It is dead. Why? Uh, and this guy uh, in front of Boulder over here. Making that save. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Uh, Two dead, and the one chained to the wall doesn't seem affected by it. Weird. It's a bit odd. Bol Boulder <laughs> just turns to dusk. My man! Gives right. you a thumbs up. Uh, Cork, <laughs> what are you doing? 
I answer the skeleton's riddle and say, it's bone meal. Your favorite food is bone meal. He stares at you. No! And slams his head back on the wall. Yes! Is that your turn? <laughs> um... I don't know where the archer skeleton is. Uh, I don't know the archer skeleton is way in the back behind the pillar. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not reaching that. Uh, I will move. Uh, I'll move right there. Like I'm done oh. with your bullshit. <laughs> Just moves away. All right. Uh, that's gonna get an attack of opportunity from the guy chained to the wall. He's chained to the wall. Uh huh. That's why he's rolling one of these. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of wiggles his toe at you. <laughs> oh, get you. Also, to the archer, I try to intimidate the archer. Uh, okay. Make intimidation. Uh, Roll intimidation. Uh, I will consider this your action, by the way. Yep, because I can't reach him, so... Does a 19 do anything? Uh... How do you intimidate him? Yeah, how how do you do it? Yeah, I allow a massive war cry. Just for funsies, we're gonna make this a contested roll. All right, nice, in right, retaliation, right. he lets out a. It's it's it's, it's not. It, I mean, he's doing his best. Okay. <laughs> And he is still scared. Orc is very unimpressed. <laughs> and, uh, for funsies, he is frightened. <laughs> so he can't actually get closer to you, and all of uh, and all of his attacks are with disadvantage. Oh, that's great, actually. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to make it work for him. for him. So sure, that works. Like, okay. So he lets out the, and then he realizes, Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> ah fuck! All right, is can that your move, turn? Can only move. That is my move. turn. I can't do anything else this turn because I only have thirty movement. So yeah, right. that's my turn. All right, uh, top of the round. Uh, you, um, something beneath your foot, uh, cork shifts. You kind of get pushed back here as another guy kind of pops up over here. And he's like, ANSWER THAT GUY'S QUESTION! <laughs> I TOLD YOU IT'S BONE MEAL! NO! <laughs> then what and else is it? He is added to the combat order. <laughs> Son of a bitch. So it's not ribs, it's not bone meal. <laughs> <laughs> I said caviar. All right, so caviar. Just sitting back there trying to figure this shit out while uh, we're just fucking. Like what, what else bone related would be a skeleton's favorite? Skeleton snack. archer over here. I don't know, pop milk. Cut. Skeleton archer over here pops out of cover, and he's gonna use his short bow to attack. Pop out there. Uh, he just pops out from behind the pillar, and he's gonna use a short bow to hit Pappy all the way in the back. Does a twenty one hit you? No, that's a disadvantage. That's a disadvantage roll. Uh, he's scared, remember? Only if he's attacking you, I think. Uh, it's attacks while in sight, if I recall. Oh, yeah. So I'm scaring him because I'm I'm right in front of him. Fair enough. Does a sixteen hit you? Sixteen does not. Okay. Uh, he let he lets loose an arrow. It kind of goes between the th the three of you guys up front here, and uh, yeah, it it whizzes by your head, but you're not really phased by it. Okay, so um, realizing that uh, <laughs> this is a fruitless endeavor. He's gonna run away. That's the dead one. Oh like, lord! Dead. Okay. Uh, Why is he dead? Or oh, no, that's a frightened one. Hey, okay, Boulder, you're up. That's some bitch. Wait, let me check. 
I can reach him. <laughs> I'm not letting this motherfucker get away. I'll, I'll deal with an attack of opportunity. Attack of opportunity on me. I'm getting this motherfucker. Okay, it's, uh... He is not armed, so it's just an unarmed attack. <laughs> he actually <laughs> nat 20 That's, that, that's oh natural 20. <laughs> yep, he did hit me. A familiar roll. <laughs> It's even worse because this guy doesn't have a sheet, so uh, I'm going to call it uh, 2d4 because he's critting. Uh, so you take five points of damage, reduced to half, because it's bludgeoning damage and you are enraged. Three. So three. Uh, that, and was, leave me alone. that was some punch. I just, I, I just can't punch. <laughs> I get a nice bruise. And uh, you keep on trucking down the, down, down the tunnel. Motherfucker, I will end you. <laughs> no, you won't. <laughs> so, yep, I'm gonna fucking swing at this bitch. Not if I run away from you. You can go away and uh, roll your attack. <laughs> He's just spouting bullshit. Eight, unfortunately, does not hit. Fucking extra attack, come on. Are you uh, fucking oh, roll another d20 for me, please? What the fuck is my luck? Average. Uh. Okay, he doesn't even know what happened there. <laughs> you just kind of swing your axe, and on the second swing, you kind of lose your grip on it, and it clatters to the floor. God damn it. <laughs> Man, today's a rough day. I think it's rough for all of us. <laughs> as he says to the skeleton. skeleton just looks at you and is like, Tell me about it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a rough day. Alright, is that yeah, your turn? My turn? Yeah. Okay, uh... It's this guy's turn, and uh, he's going to attempt to punch you, Cork. Yay. Eleven! No. <laughs> no. That doesn't do anything. He tried. And he just kind of stands there, not entirely sure what to do. <laughs> it's like he punches, and then he just ends the okay? All right, uh... I just woke up. All right, Pappy, you're up. Uh, Pappy, still by this other skeleton, is still kind of trying to think of the answer. You got this, Pappy. Are you laughing? No, I'm thinking. It sounded like you were chuckling. Why are you laughing? I haven't told the punchline yet. Well, what's the fucking punchline? Yes! I did. Is that your turn? Yes. Arguing uh, with the stupid skeleton. All right. Uh, it's actually that stupid skeleton's turn now. Uh, he's going to use a free action. Yes! Still chained to the wall. Uh, Dusk, you're up. <laughs> <laughs> Just scream. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh... Oh, is... Oh, no, that was that skeleton. Yes. Uh, so, Dusk is going to uh, step around and get into flanking position and start uh, beating the ever-living shit out of the skeleton. <laughs> uh, okay. Make that attack. Watch him! <laughs> Attack. Advantage. He crumbles. <laughs> just anything. Just, he, 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 is, he is Hulk smash. He, he looked like he was on his way out, and honestly, it's a miracle he landed that natural fucking 20, so... Uh, yep. Yeah, he, he crumbles. He's gone. Is that your turn? Man's gone. Uh, oh, I only moved three, so, uh, it's, uh, one, uh, two, and three. Get closer to the rest of the party. Yes, hey, uh, good luck this guy getting the fuck away from me. I have such good movement speed. Uh, okay, Cork. Oh, right. It's the answer bone dip. 
It was supposed to be like bone chips. Make a. Mm, charisma save. <laughs> charisma save, okay. Uh... Wow, that did not work. That really didn't work. He, 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 he looks at you... He's... It looks like he's offended by your pathetic guess. And he's like, No! WHY MUST YOU FAIL ME SO OFTEN?! And you are hurt by these words. Oh. You are genuinely hurt. I'm trying my best. You take one point of damage. <laughs> A whole damage One point, point. of emotional damage. <laughs> of mental oh, damage. How do I turn off what I just did? Is that your turn? Um... I guess I'll... Where's the skeleton? I'm assuming that uh, he's uh, way over here. Yeah, way over here. Which would be I can reach him. Uh, Leo. This motherfucker. Wait, that's thirty. So ah, I can barely reach him. I don't know if diagonals work, but I believe that's yeah, still thirty. That's, that's still in range. Okay. Okay. Make okay. an attack. I dropped my fucking axe! Okay, inventory, oral short sword, attack roll. Is this a flank? I don't believe it's counting no. a flank. No, okay. this is not a flank. So, uh, just a normal roll. 20 hits! Yeah. Go ahead, roll damage. Okay. Plus, that thing is terrified of you. Uh, that oh, one... yeah, I think I would have advantage on him then, wouldn't I? Or does that not apply to scared? I don't know. I Anyways, don't believe I did so. I don't remember. So, uh, that's uh, six points of damage. And uh, here comes the, the next attack roll. Aliu. Uh, ten, I'm assuming ten does not hit. Fortunately, does not hit. Yeah, that first okay. attack, that, that first attack, oh my god, that, you just fucked up that guy's rib cage. like, it is, half of it is gone, and he is, he is not looking good. The second attack, unfortunately, <laughs> he kind of staggers back and recovers a little bit, and, and, like, you almost land a hit, but it goes through the rest of the rib cage and just misses entirely. Oh. Too much of it was oh, removed. Oh, I forgot the first it. Axe of the second one went through. All right, so is that your turn? That would be my turn. Yeah. All right, it's his turn. He's like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? He's like, I gotta get out of here. And he starts running, <laughs> prompting attacks of opportunity from both of you. Okay. <laughs> I'll let you go first. Tell you. Uh, 12, 12, unfortunately, 12. does not hit. Okay. Right, let me try. I think? No, it doesn't hit. Wow, Boulder is not... Fucking damn it! My rolls are crap. so bad today! He gets away from you! <laughs> it's five, Good luck 10, him staying away 15, from me. 20, 25, 30, and he's gonna use his action to dash for another 30 feet of movement down into the trap door! And disappears into the lower section of the mines. This bitch ass bitch, fuck. And with that, well, combat that... comes to an end. And the party emerges victorious against the spooky, scary skeletons. Ah, uh, damn it. We're gonna so, is the answer like here. bone chips or. He just looks at you and he's like. Go away. <laughs> God fuck it. We'll never know. Is, is it is it bone bones? Uh ghost peppers? Uh is it even pun related? You suck at this! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe do an investigative check of what he's trying what he wants? I don't know. Is it 
Is it milk? No! <laughs> Don't you have uh, a hat it... to kill or something? Is it out? No, no, milk? she can wait. Good. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Hmm. Did you did you hear the punchline or? No, no, he's still he's still asking me to guess here. Because he totally sucks at it. Why must you hey, fail Hambo. me so often? Maybe hey, you Hambo. suck at hella jokes. Yeah, this is the worst joke ever. Well, maybe you suck at living. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the oh, that's what it is, huh? Fucking Boulder comes up and just grabs the top of the skull, uses his other hand and rips the lower jaw off. I can strength check it if you want. No, no, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just rip his lower jaw. So you go ahead, you rip his lower jaw off, and uh, he starts going. Oh, well, I guess this one's favorite snack isn't jawbreakers. <laughs> <laughs> He takes maximum damage for vicious mockery. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you uh, you think about that, bud. You you think about that, and I just like. I bet the answer is also I, 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 dropping. Oh, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> God, this poor skeleton's having the worst day ever. <laughs> <laughs> not only I, is I, he not getting the answer, he's I getting made fun of the puns thrown at him. Fucking roasted. <laughs> Boulder breaks the lower jaw into two pieces so that they can, you know, it's thinner in the middle, and he just sticks both ends, like either end, like of the two pieces, into both of the eye sockets and walks away. <laughs> <laughs> This motherfucker was his, telling me the goddamn joke. With his hand chained to the wall, he flips you off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck you too, buddy. <laughs> All right, so uh, move, moving on deeper into the mines. Uh, yeah, the rest of the way looks clear. Does... It seemed like that guy had a real bone to pick with us after that. <laughs> oh. He's just consistently taking damage from everyone telling better jokes. <laughs> This guy, he looks so fresh. Poor man. He looks like an adventurer from the Adventuring Guild. Oh, I guess his days of adventuring are over. I guess he took an arrow to the knee. Yeah, marriage does do that to you. <laughs> okay, so uh, you guys are heading through the trapdoor? Yes. Yeah, yeah. it's the only right. other option, so yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, it opens. Clearly, the skeleton didn't have time to lock it on his way down, and uh, you head. Did we get that right? Deeper into the mines. <laughs> the deep mines. The deep <laughs> mines. Well, that's a lot of skulls. And I mean, that's a lot of skulls. Way at the end of the hallway, you can see that same skeleton. He's still running, still trying to escape. Get back there! What do you want to Getting do? The best work out of his own life. I'll do an yeah, investigative please. check. What are you investigating? Uh, just to check with the straps. Okay. He probably would have hit them, but who knows? I didn't even think about that. Well, that's just I, I didn't get he really anything. Know. He probably knows that they're. If the they're only there. thing you really notice is uh, another jack o' lantern over here. I like. Not jack even on the way. And uh, look, turning around. Oh, dear God, that's a lot of skulls. Yeah, that's a lot of skulls. That bastard. We're gonna kick her ass, I swear to God. I'm moving on up. Do it, wait, do I see anybody in the cages? Uh... As a matter of fact, you do. Oh, no. Over in this cage... cage you see, uh, what looks to be an old man. He's like, eh, Help! Help me! Oh, shit. Guys, we have some live ones down here. You gotta get me okay, out of here! Okay, I'll open up the cage. I'll open up this cage. Uh, before, you, check. 
before you can open that cage, you hear from the other side of the room over here, um, he's like, No! Douche! There's an imposter! Oh my god. Oh. Um, and then, I do investigate. And, and then from then. this, and then from this cage, what? I'm not the imposter. You're the imposter. And then over here, you're the imposter. And then over here, I said I'm not being the imposter, but you over there are definitely being the imposter. Dusk. And then back over here, <laughs> the boulders just whining at this point. Mr. Elf, tell him how much of an imposter he's being. Dusk, please help. I'm not smart. <laughs> God damn it, Steve. <laughs> what are we laughing at? He, he played, he played the, the Among Us, us noise. Theme. <laughs> oh, fuck you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Apostor sauce Among Us. Anyway. <laughs> Dusk, help, I'm stupid. They're trying to say one of them is an imposter. It's, you hear it from over here. It's because that guy is an imposter! And then this guy's like, I told you I ain't an imposter! You're the imposter, you imposter, imposter! Guys, I don't know who's the imposter here. I'm so confused. What do you guys want to do? <laughs> Dusk, can you see through ruses like this? Because I sure as shit can't. While you guys are uh, figuring this out, you can hear from the top of the stairs. Yes! God, God damn it! it. <laughs> Motherfucker. He managed to get up! I will attempt to investigate. Okay. I'm stupid as shit. Jesus is one I need brain to, cell. I need oh my control. gosh, Boulder's brain cell was working yeah. today. Yeah, I'm trying to see if I can discern which one may be the imposter. <laughs> you can't tell, actually. Oh. I can't figure it out. Like. I mean, unless we want to open one at a time and figure it out like, the hard way. This guy could be the imposter, or it, th this guy could be the imposter. Could go either way. You're not entirely sure yet. I mean, if they start attacking us, I know what to do. So, I'm going to open up this cage first and see if something okay. happens. And I'll open up this one uh, after you open that one. Okay, so that'll be a strength check, right? So, you yes. are going to open up both cages. Not at the same time. Uh, at the same time, no. Okay. One more time. Uh, who's going first? I am. So, okay. ability okay. check. Make that normal. roll. Wow! Cork did not do well today. It doesn't give, actually. Uh, the guy in the oh. cage is like, Come on! I know you can do it! Put your back into it, Sonny! Uh, okay. Oh, yeah. Um, Boulder? I'll give a try on this one. Wow! We're uh, fast today. Yeah. Uh, neither of them are opening up. Come on. We got this. The, I'll retry that. The guy in the cage is like, What is wrong with you? Come on! Put on your Nikes! Pump it up and air it out! Okay, fine. I'll try again. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> 13, wow. DC is we're 14. The <laughs> oh the my god. We're the strongest people and we're struggling. This is actually a fairly strong cage. It's surprising. Hey. Alright, Boulder, you finally get your cage open. <laughs> okay, I, pick, I, pick up, I pick up the man. And, Are and, and, you and, an and, imposter? And, and, He's like, no, I'm not the imposter. That guy's the imposter. And, it, and as he points towards the cage. I got 20. Oh, no, we did open both at the same time. He points towards the cage right as Cork gets gets the cage open. He's like, oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for being so dumb. And the old man kind of fades away and makes way for one of the hags. 
It's Eclair from the sweet shop! <gasps> that? Uh, well... Old man, get out of here. What was her HP at earlier? <laughs> I don't know. Like you guys, yeah, well, yeah, you guys you. beat the crap out of her. All right, she's down. In a, okay, I got it. Um, uh, wait, what was it again? Oh my god! You got this. Okay, yeah, no, I, uh, just double checking. Okay, old man, you got to get out of here. Okay, now you guys could go ahead and roll initiative. Well, oh, I made a mistake. Yes, I yes, you, you did. You one at a time. <laughs> Not twenty. <laughs> <laughs> that is a natural fucking twenty, though. For a new actor. <laughs> hey, old bitch. Do you know what a skeleton's favorite snack is? Two nat twenties. Twenty. <laughs> Initiative. We're ready. Very nice. <laughs> 21 on initiative. Wow! We got yeah, two 21s boys. on initiative. A 19 two 21s and a 19 and 17. Well, she goes last. I can't believe that she actually goes last. This could go. Hey, buddy, I've got a sword with your name on it. Okay, uh, Cork. This is Wall, the. Cage door is actually over here. Oh. You can put okay. yourself in front of the door because uh, you were trying well, to open I the door, yes? Open. Yeah, I'm also trying He's to block her from getting out. Okay. Yeah, so cool. Short cool. sword, uh, attack roll. Uh, I don't think there's anyone. Yeah, I know. Just a normal roll. God damn. Ah, dang it. Well, like, like, initiative, we got it. Actually hitting something? No, only dusting uh, things. <laughs> Okay, it wasn't your turn. <laughs> but yes, it was. I, I got 21. Uh. Okay, very well, very well. Uh, Pappy and Cork are going here at the same time. Yeah, awesome. so Pappy would also uh, go. Uh, you, you should have, uh. You should have Pappy go first, as I can go ahead and just, uh, pull out old reliable guiding bolt. Okay. And then you get advantage on yours. Oh! If I hit, obviously. I will say that Cork okay. has already made their attack roll. Oh, Cork has? Yes. Yeah, I didn't hit. Oh. Sorry. Oh, well. I gotta be mean. <laughs> oh, well, that's on me. Uh, so... Uh, fuck it, let's just go ahead and, uh, swap out Bless. Instead. Uh... So I'm gonna go ahead and place a bless upon uh, Dusk, Cork, and Boulder. Okay, you go ahead and you bless the entire party. I feel blessed. Hashtag bless. Bless. Oh, someone already did that for me. Thank you. Whoever yeah. did that. You're welcome. <laughs> spare the dying on this old man. Uh, yeah. Also, sparing spare the dying on this old man over here. As a bonus action. <laughs> Alright, uh, as your bonus action, you cast Spare the Dying on the old man. He's like, uh, uh, mm, uh, You fixed my shoulder! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, it didn't actually do anything, but... <laughs> you're welcome. He he gives you a, like a sugar pill. He gives you a really shaky thumbs up, because he's old. <laughs> I'd imagine it's like, Spare the Dying, I'm not dead old! <laughs> uh, Cork, do you have another attack? Oh yeah, I do! Give more than one attack. Go. All right. Uh, go ahead and make that attack. I Bless forgot me. about it. Thank you for reminding me. No problem, Bob. <laughs> That's how to hit. That hits. That go ahead and roll damage. It was almost a crit. It was almost a crit, but that hits. So okay. That absolutely hits. Go ahead, roll damage. Damage. Normal hit. Mm -hmm. A seven. Seven points of damage. All right, so you thrust your sword straight at uh, straight at the hag's chest. He goes, "Ah, you bastard! I'll kill you <laughs> and your short friend over there." 
Wow! Prejudice much? Yo! Short one! <laughs> Who the fuck you calling short? You're a short motherfucker and nobody likes you! Everywhere you go and people say, look how short that person is, and that keeps you from forming meaningful relationships! Oh, are you hey, saying Boulder, that about Pappy? Hey, Boulder, can you show up this hag? Oh, I wanna. Pappy, can you, uh... It's actually pull... your turn! Pappy, can you roll a d2 for me? A d2? Yeah, just a d2. You realize... She's kind of got a point. <laughs> Doesn't really do anything, though. <laughs> Don't listen to her, Pappy. I had a lot of meaningful relationships right. in my life. <laughs> Cork, is that Including your turn? my children. Cork, is that your turn? Uh, yeah, I don't have any other actions. All right, Boulder, oh wait, up. yes I do. What? Well, no, if I go back, if I back up, she has an attack of opportunity. Yeah, so yeah, I have to stay. Would here, I be I... able to attack diagonally through the door? How big is? I the mean, door? um, I'll allow it. I just wasn't sure how big the door was, so I wanted to be sure. You some bitch! Well, is it, how much? How well did you roll on that strength check to get it open? Was that a twenty? I got 20, yeah. Yeah, alright, you ripped it open wide enough. Gonna fuck this bitch up. Alright. Where's my Go thing? Go for it. Here's my thing. Hey. That unfortunately oh, does not hit. Oh, wait, I should have done a 1d4 with that, shouldn't I? Because I'm blessed. Cause it's oh, not yeah. Hit, isn't it? Well, Go I ahead. think what a 12 still works, though. Well, it's 1d4, I'd have to say, yeah, I don't think a 12 would hit, though. So it wouldn't matter. And... What? 1d4? I'll add it this time, I don't forget. <laughs> Unfortunately, 11 does not hit. Motherfucker. I tried. Right, so... So... Uh, you come in with your great axe, but it... Yeah, I said the gate was, too, was wide enough, but... You, can't really get an angle on her, and you, you try to take a couple swings at her, but she's she's not having it. She's she's backing up from you a little bit. She's like, "Ha! You are too large, large one. I'm a big boy. Too big. And you're too and you're short. Too big, and you're fat. <laughs> and." That that the boulder coming just from the care. person who is more gaunt than freaking more bone than skin at this point. Yeah, look how fucking ugly you are. What are you yeah. doing, swinging that big axe, trying to compensate for that tiny dick? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boulder's not even ashamed. Yes. She hears that. She's she's kind of taken aback for a second. She's like, <laughs> okay, but fuck you anyway. Is that your turn? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, Dusk. Run away, old man. Run away, old man. Whoosh! Well, yeah, uh... Dusk is gonna go ahead and... I guess just blast a... Blast a good old, uh... Guide and Bolt. How many? Actually, no, I only have two spell slots left. Let's do old Reliable. Toll the dead. Oh, boy. <laughs> so that's a wisdom saving throw. Yep, DC 14. How wise are you? you Better than the sea hag, at least. Clang, clang. And she's already injured, right? Uh, yeah. yes, by quite a bit. So right. 2d12 uh, damage. She, like, you can see she's bleeding. All right, that's more average damage. Ooh. Ten. Ten points of damage. Clanging on the armor, then flips her off. Right, so you <laughs> clang on your armor, and she kind of puts her hands on her ears, like, and lets out a shriek. It doesn't hurt any of you, but it it it's grating. It's slightly uncomfortable to listen to. Is that your turn? Uh, yeah. Uh, 
That, yep, I... Yep, that's all I can do for now. All right. Uh, now it is the hag's turn. Once again, realizing... Well, this is fucked. Uh, uh, you know what? Fuck you guys! And she, and she will use her action to cast Invisible Passage. And she turns invisible. But where is she going? We're both blocking the door. Yeah, say, how would she get past? Well, we don't know where she's going. She might just be still in the cage. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I mean, that's my big It'd guess. It'd be hard for her to get past it, yeah. up There's clearly her. two big bodybuilders in front of her cage. There's two meat heads the in the doorway. <laughs> or unless she, she's a skinny bitch, she might be able to just meander around us. I don't that know. is her turn. Uh, Pappy, you're up. You realize that she left no physical evidence of her passage. She could be in the cage. She could not be in the cage. You have no idea. Well. Uh. I mean, we could just go ahead and try this. Uh, Pappy is going to, uh, place the hand on the chest and a from inside a burst of red comes out and the air itself fills with various types of candy and little candy creatures as uh, I go ahead and cast upon myself spirit guardians uh, and Pappy is going to uh Move on over. Yeah. Attach it to yourself. Uh, I don't think it attached to my. Yeah, no, it did not attach to myself. But uh. Put it on you, and you right-click it. I'm not sure. Uh, regardless. Uh, yeah, Pappy is going to uh <laughs> activate Spirit Guardians, and oh, it, nope. Okay. <laughs> And then just kind of, like, do a loop. <laughs> and, yeah, and the uh, spirit guardians are always located, like, around Pappy's. And, and so this radius moves, moves with you. Yes. Correct, correct, according to the spell. Yeah, it moves with uh, Pappy, so it's a big-ass radius that's going to move with them. And I can designate any number of creatures to be unaffected. Uh, and, obviously, I choose all of my friends. And old man. <laughs> Oh yeah, and the old man. <laughs> Kill the old, the old man, Candy. Kill him now. Just as peppermint golem walks up and caves their skull in. Peppermint, no. <laughs> um. Okay, so if I have, if I'm reading this right, if she enters this radius, which keeps moving around. She's gonna have to make a wisdom save. Uh, correct. It, it, it is only the once per turn. Okay. Uh, if I may. Or... So, you get about here, and then she does have to make that save. Excellent. How big of a radius is this? 15 feet. 15 feet, yeah. Gotcha. Which she makes! Hoo-hoo! Uh, half as much damage on a success. So... So, uh... uh still, still whammaged. Okay. But, Oof. uh, 47. Oh. Seven points of damage! Yep. And she does have to make a concentration check on that invisibility! Yeah. Oh, right! Which I believe <laughs> is... Where's the button for that? Uh, I think it's just Constitution. Uh, con, con save? Correct. Uh, concentration is based on Constitution saving throw. Alright. 
I couldn't remember what the hell it was either. Oh wow. dear God! <laughs> <laughs> The the hag reappears. I'm <laughs> sure she did get out. And, and, and she's like, "What the fuck?" And she looks at all of you like, "Ah oh, shit!" <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, it's yeah. my turn now, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah uh, uh, actually, yeah. You go. Hey. Both go. Uh, all right. What are you doing? <laughs> well. Uh, also, one last thing. Pappy cast spare the dying on Cork. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, you, uh, Cork, you feel mentally reinvigorated. Okay, well, short sword, attack roll, normal. I'm considering spare the dying. Oh, well, I also uh, supposed to have, have a plus four or plus one. D4 doesn't matter, that hits. Go ahead, roll damage. Yeah, yeah, that's what I figured. Doesn't matter, that hits. Eight, Eight damage. points of damage. Ho, 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 ho. Ooh, yeah, you, uh, you slash into her shoulder, and, and she's like, ah, my shoulder, my and favorite shoulder. She's and not looking forget, good. Here comes the, here comes the next attack roll. I forgot to put blessing again. Uh, Eleven, unfortunately, does not hit. <laughs> nope. Remember, I have a blessed roll as well. I have a blessed roll as well. Still don't hit. Thirteen. Okay, still not hit. Okay. You wouldn't have been able to hit her with a 15 anyway, don't worry. Oh, okay. Alright, is that your turn? <laughs> that would be my turn, yes. Fantastic. Uh, Boulder, <laughs> bring the pain. I'm gonna go and go around without attack of opportunity to flank. Because fuck this bitch. Okay, make your attack with advantage. Okay, it Advantage. Okay, roll damage. Get the feeling that hits. I don't even need a D4. Christ on a bike. And... <laughs> oh, <that laughs> Eleven hurt. points on damage. No way, that's plus something, right? Open plus no. what? No, I am nope. not raging right now. I lost my rage. Oh, right okay. Oh, okay. You, you still had your strength. Oh, it does it still have I thought that was only when I'm rage. Okay, uh, no, no, yeah. No, rage gives you bonus damage. You, with... Well, rage, but I'm not raged. You, with righteous anger, swing your great axe down, and almost tag-teaming with Cork, land on the other shoulder, and it's like, ah! 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 She is <laughs> still hanging on, but by a thread. And let me guess, Boulder can attack twice. Here's to hope. Uh, yes. Oh, <laughs> that's a natural <laughs> fucking 20. That's what I call. Oof. I don't think this hag's gonna that's have a right, very good a, end. Uh, yeah. Uh, how do you want to do this? <laughs> <laughs> Literally, Boulder's going through, like, where he flips it over his head and goes in for a clean, like, with the great axe to try to chop her head off. He goes for the head chop. Where the hell is my pen? It was here just a second ago. I need to mark the time. <laughs> I finally get a good roll, and it's just to fuck her up. Oh, that okay, roll. so you're gonna cleave her head off? Yes. Okay, That's you the goal. do so. You go right into the neck. It just cleaves it right off in one real good swing. It kind of splurts into the wall a little bit here and kind of kind of bounces down and rolls right here as the hags as the hags headless body collapses to the ground. Kind of twitches a little bit. Some death spasms here and there. I guess you could say she got her just desserts. And then she finally stops. Boulder just raises this axe in the air with both hands going, whoop! And then for some, and then for some hag bullshit, uh, the head looks at you, Cork, and says, Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it does have some sentience just like for ten seconds afterwards, so... 
and the hag is dead. But as the oh, hag yeah. crumples to the ground with knowledge that you remembered from earlier, hag covens are groups of three. Oh. No worries, we're going to get the last one. I bet that's where that skilla man ran off to. Well, I mean, there's only one we're way you could have go. gone. There's no other directions, and so... with that, we're going to go ahead and end combat. Old man, you gotta get out of here. Uh, yeah, okay. Just, 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 just go out. You'll be okay. We killed everything on the way. Have you seen my teeth? No. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, sorry. He cut up. There is there is a jaw on the floor upstairs that uh, you maybe you could be able to use. Kind of, kind of hobbles up the stairs a little bit. After a I few mean, moments, you, after a few moments, you hear gas. <laughs> <laughs> How did he get his jaw back in place? Like poured into yes! two pieces. <laughs> What is my favorite snack? Ignore him, old man. <laughs> All right, so uh, what's the party doing? I guess we're going to continue going this way. Uh, oh, wait, is there anything interesting on the hag? Oh, that's... I didn't think about that, yeah. Anything uh, Pappy you? steals her wallet. Yeah, Pappy steals uh, wallet. Okay, yeah, you steal her wallet. This... Uh, Looks to be filled with uh, just a few of the coins that weren't in the uh, that weren't in the bakery at the time. Like this is the co coin that she kept on her. And yeah, there's about uh, fourteen uh, silvers in there. Thanks. Hey, it's Pappy. You're getting there. Gonna be rich. And nothing else of note on her on her person. Uh, there is a human heart. I'm not, I'm not taking that. We're just, uh, yeah. Wait, what if they use it for spells or something? Like, Boulder just takes it and just stomps on the heart. Oh, okay. So it's ruined. This is paranoia. You do notice the head is gone. Oh. Oh, dear. Yeah, that was fast. Oh, like her head disappeared after I crushed the heart? Maybe, maybe not. You're not entirely sure. Anyway, uh, what's Mari mm. doing? We must continue onward. Uh, doing an investigate check. Murder awaits. Hey, you. Uh, what are you checking investigating? For traps. Traps? Just checking for traps. Um, door yeah, symbol. hallway looks clear. You do see um, it looks to be some kind of wall with a door up ahead. Mm. Hey, Boulder, go kick it. Yes, unless it's unlocked. No, no, just just kick it. Okay. Doesn't matter if it's locked or not. It's about style points. Also, there's a bunch of stuff over there. Hey, look, there's uh, the skeleton right 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 right. Right. Rounding the corner, uh, you see this skeleton over here. Um, as you round the corner, Cork, he's like, Oh, dear God! <laughs> oh, hello, buddy! And he seems to be, like, pounding on some kind of wall over here. He's like, let me in! Let me in! And he finally breaks through. Fuck. Oh. Uh... I mean, I can still kick this door in, but that might be interesting, too. Well, you did say kick it in. I kicked the door. Uh, okay, make a strength check. It's just like, well, Pappy said, better do it. <laughs> that doesn't open it. Damn it. I tried just opening the door. It opens. Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I was oh, gonna Pappy, charge. I did it. It's unlocked, okay. so it's okay. Where's the style in there? I, I kicked it, though. Yeah, but you're supposed to kick it open. I'm sorry. All right, so heading I'll inside. This looks to be like some kind of old minor barracks of some sort. Oh. 
Oh, there's crates. Oh, wait, there's check a, there's what's a, in the crate. There's a chest back here. Fuck, it's dark. Oh, yeah, there's a big chest. Is the chest... Is it? Wait, I don't know if I can check for traps on a chest. I can try. I'm going to investigate it. I mean, everyone can look for traps, but, uh, you know, we just kind of trust I'm us. I'm stupid. Looks clean. Uh, I try to open it. It's locked. I smash it. <laughs> Strength check, please. I will solve all of my problems by punching them if I can. Uh, yeah, you, you can go ahead and Kratos slam that. Yes. And I open it. Abre! This bunch of empty bottles in here. Damn. Oh, that's unimpressive. <laughs> that's okay. I... Boulder puts a couple of the bottles in his bag in case he wants to throw it at something. Gosh, that's not Happy right. doesn't trust that. Hey, Dusk, have another look in there. Uh, Happy wants Dusk to... Shimmy sham, I need to actually move my character tokens forward. Okay, I'll get uh, all the way for you. I, uh, I, I forget it sometimes, too. <laughs> Dusk, you're oh, smarter than me. Uh, Dusk wants to look for secret compartments in there. There's no way a locked chest just doesn't have loot in it. Okay, uh, make an investigation check. Hell yes. Okay, uh, no secret compartments, but there is the faintest smell of alcohol. It looks like this is where the miners kept the, kept the good stuff. And of course, they want to keep that locked up. However, you do hear a little bit of shuffling over in the corner. I snap to the corner. Okay. Bunch of crates. Dusk points to the crates. I, it, d what, what's there? Cork, what's over there? You want me to smash the crates open or what? Maybe don't smash them, but... Oh, okay. Like, yeah, let's just, like, check them out. Okay. Okay, so I... you are going to go over to the crates? Yep. Okay. You don't have to roll for this. So the moment you look over the back of these, this uh, little goblin dude jumps out. He's like, ooh, ooh, and he starts running out of the room. Should we, uh... Does anybody stop him? I, mean, I guess I'll try to stop him. Uh, okay, make... Uh... Grab him by the collar. I forget what it is to grab someone. That'd be a uh, strength athletics. check. Athletics. Well, guess what? I have a plus seven in, boys! Uh, Fourteen. Uh, uh, okay, we are going... To... It's contested, so... Uh... My athletics is a plus eight, so I feel you. You do not oh, hit him. Shit. He slips out of your grasp and goes between your legs, and uh, he's still shimmying towards the exit. Anyone else? It's up to Dusk and Pappy. I'm too far away. Uh, y yeah, sure. I'll see if, uh, Dusk and Pappy can do a little boo grabby grabby. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> this goblin is right. just getting away. All right, Pappy's right, time. Almost out. Natural one. <laughs> no, uh, never mind. <laughs> he just slips. You he know what? No. Nope. hits the floor. Goblin kicks you in the balls. <laughs> what if the goblin gets in that one too, though? <laughs> he starts running towards the barrier. God damn it. Apparently where it's happening is out there. And he starts going, whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, you son of a bitch. Pappy is going to uh, step out, put up the middle <laughs> finger, and cast Toll the Dead on the goblin. He is already around the corner. Uh, unfortunate. The goblin's dead. Gonna wreck him. Let's go, boys. Oh, well, there's only one way we can go, and it's this way. Ask, you're the smartest. Okay, so you notice that the barrier is now down. 
Well, I guess we can get like, there's the, oops. There, there's various parts where there where this is a wall, but the invisible barriers are now gone, so you can now pass through. I guess Let's I'll go, go in and... first. We both go in first. We're champions. We're beefy. Okay. All right. So you Boys. enter the room. Yep. And I had to try to on the other side of the room, you see another hag all the way back there. And she's like, all right, so we got you and we've got you. Anyone else? And the goblin is like, no, we're the only ones who made it back. And she's like, damn it. And then, th wait. And she notices you guys over there and she's like, how did you get in here? Somebody left dumb the barrier your down. Your dumbass buddies broke it no, down. Oh, you stupid minion! You, you left the barrier open! How could you do such a thing? He's like, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do it. And that's just fucking great. That's, that's fantastic. I can't believe this shit. Great. These brutes come into my house kill my skeletons <laughs> throw back away. to begin with you wouldn't have to know happen to know what a skeleton's favorite food is she turns to she turns to uh you boulder and she's like shut up while i'm while i'm reprimanding my subordinates and throws a rock at you <laughs> i was the one who said that so she wrote, throws brock at you too <laughs> We both did say something sassy. <laughs> it's not big. It does no damage. <laughs> or like Boulder catches it. <laughs> just like, okay. Would you like to catch it? Probably could, or just duck my head. Make a dexterity check if you want to catch it. <laughs> I want to catch it. I guess I'll do a dexterity check as well. Is it Rocks for everybody. It oh, ability. Uh, yeah, no, it still yeah. clinks off your armor. Doesn't do any damage. It's on, bitch. Nope. Clinkity dinkity dink. Why do you and me get the same rolls with such different modifiers? <laughs> so, well, this is just fucking perfect. Great. I know, best day, right? I'll have to move to another town. Start a new hag coven, and I hated the ones that I was working with to begin with. I hate it here. Great. I'm gonna have to start all over again. And I know who my first victims will be. Gee, I need everyone to roll initiative. <laughs> me? Just like that line, uh... Another I... net 20, let's go! <laughs> oh! Let me guess, mine's pretty bad. Yep. Yeah, we didn't do good. I just remember one of my favorite lines from in Baldur's Gate 3 from Carlac was the, That sounded like a threat! I love threats. It's like, yeah, uh, but okay. Did someone else get a 20? That terrified the skeleton, skeleton rolled a 20. <laughs> He's on high alert because he's terrified. Oh, uh, by the way, I should mention, Spirit Guardians goes for ten minutes. Uh, okay, yeah, you can keep that. You've only been going for, like, maybe, I'd say eight. Oh, hang on, is it this button? Maybe, maybe less. No, the point you is, you still have. should be able to right-click to keep it on you. Oh, well, the skeleton actually goes first. I can't move closer to specifically you. Okay, beginning combats. So, first up is the very scared skeleton. Uh, they're gonna take a shot at Boulder because, uh... God, they shoot me! They're not terrified of Boulder, but they can see you, Cork. So the attack is with disadvantage. <laughs> And I should probably give him a chance to get rid of that and have him roll a wisdom save. Yeah, I don't know how it works. I don't remember. Uh, every turn. Nope. <laughs> nope. You still definitely still terrified. Scared. Uh. 
Also, does a 12 hit you? No. <laughs> okay. All right, he's gonna go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and then he's gonna climb on top of this cage here. You pussy! <laughs> get, a, get a better angle on everyone in the room. Uh, that's his turn. Cork, you're up. Oh, right, I got 21, didn't I? Uh, get up! Okay, I'm gonna switch to my bow. So we're gonna do that first. Which I believe takes movement points. So that does drop my armor cost to six. I shouldn't say anything. Um, um, I'm pretty sure it's just your movement. Oh, it just cost my movement, period? Yes. I remember. Switching weapons, that just costs your movement. 150 feet. Oh, yeah, I'm good. It's 150 feet to attack. So, uh, yeah. Um, who should I hit? I'm going to hit the goblin, actually. That little guy. Yep. He's asking for this it. This asshole. Wait, am I still blessed? Yes. Uh, how long does Maybe. blessed last? Yeah, a know. minute. No, I, you, I so you guys yeah. are not blessed at this point. Okay, then. Uh, normal roll, then. That hits. That's a 20. Uh, yeah, the 20 does hit. I would hope so, otherwise that's a beefed up goblin. <laughs> Go ahead and roll damage. Okay. A seven. He takes Good it shit. in the fucking chest. <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> hey, Cork, can you make a, um... Make an investigation check for me real quick? Okay. Ugh. Yeah. That is some information you did not want to recall. You seem to recall hags can sometimes have brainwashed minions, and that guy had an adventure guild insignia on him. Oh. You just killed one of your fellow adventurers. <laughs> Dude. You feel sad. Uh, Aww. don't say he's dead just yet. I do have spare the dying. Oh yeah! Never he does, mind. He does have exactly seven hit points. I will allow it. <laughs> so it's okay. he's just at zero. Okay. I wonder but after I they dodge, they sever that link. Maybe I don't, I don't know. If you want to go this route, uh, Cork, is that your turn? Wait, um, you have another attack. You can shoot it. Yes, I do. So hitting the hag. Okay. Uh, Attack roll again. Nine that definitely doesn't Fortunately, hit. does not hit. Rip. Just whizzes on past. All right. Is that for? That it? That would be it. All right. I, I used I used my movement for um. It the is the hag's turn. So she is gonna go five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. 30, and she is going to spot you. Uh, why, am I, candy. why am I putting yeah. Pappy, sorry. She's going to spot you, Pappy. She's going to be like, look how fucking short that guy is. That must keep you from forming meaningful relationships and cast a vicious why? mockery at you. I already heard that one, bitch. Yes, but this time she's casting vicious mockery. I need you to make a wisdom save. The two of Pappy. Ouch. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Man, you could not take... Words are hurting you today. <laughs> Apparently. All right, you are going to take two points of uh, psychic Mental damage. Mental damage. <laughs> Pappy, don't I'm listen to her. You're damage. perfect the way you are. Emotional damage. Happy, you're beautiful the way you are. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Alright, uh, that was... I swear, hags have... Don't hags have extra attack? No. Uh, it depends on the level of hag, I guess. I wouldn't. One second. Well, casting a spell... You can't cast two spells. It would be two claw attacks. 
or something similar, or cast spell. Unless they have some special abilities. Okay, yeah, it doesn't say anything about Hags having an extra attack. Uh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. You know what? I'm gonna give her a spell and an attack, but she's used all her movements, so just that's for the future. Uh, that's her turn. Uh, Boulder, you're up. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm gonna let her do well, two things because this is supposed to be the this is supposed to be the hard fight. <laughs> That's it. I'm raging and I'm a Hulk smashing. Okay. Make your attack. You can do it, Boulder. I believe in you. I'm trying. What the fuck? Unfortunately, no. Uh, Dude, my rolls. And your second attack? That, that does hit. Go ahead and roll damage. Damage. God, I already forgot what my fucking bonus was. Oh no, it's just a plus two damage. Great. I'm just a dongus. Oof. Oh my god. So it's 14. 12. 12 points of damage. 14. I forgot the plus two. Because I forget how to add that. You, you still get. You also get your. What? What is your strength? Uh, my strength. One sec. My strength is a plus. What is it? Plus five. What? Oh yeah, because you're raging. I, I have twenty strength. Okay, so. Uh, or it says your... plus eight. It says plus eight on some of my things. Okay, like so. Check. Your strength modifier should be added to your damage, so when you're raging, it should be plus seven. And plus on your attack rolls, you are, aren't including your proficiency bonus. You should be rolling with a uh, plus eight, not a plus five. Gotcha. So minus another three. Uh, no, minus... He, he's raging right now, right? Uh, yes. so yeah. 12 be, plus... 5 plus the additional rage damage, which is rage 2, two or 3? So, 2. two. So, yes. So, it's so that, plus that it'd be 19 in total. Gotcha. I just need to start rolling it manually. Okay! Yeah. Barbarian strong. Yep, I keep forgetting to add that shit because it's just... God, it's such a bitch for me to try to make it. Alright, so you cleave into her and, you, and she's like, You call that... Leaving my spine, I could ah my spleen, my bones. What? Ah, she is reeling from that one. What you fucking get? Is that your turn? Yes. Okay, dusk. Uh, and Pappy's on deck. Hella. Uh. Dusk is gonna go ahead and I, I was just anticipating having to do some more stuff here, but uh, Dusk is gonna go ahead and say fuck it and uh, I have, yeah, I have more than enough. Uh, that's not the right one. <laughs> Oops. So, nope. Still wrong tool. <laughs> Just trying to rule her tool. And yeah. Uh, while getting into flanking position, uh, Dusk's eyes flash silver and uh, gonna go ahead and use... Actually, oh fuck that. Not that one. Uh, Gonna go ahead and yeah, fuck it. Let's just inflict wounds. I'm flanking. Okay. It's a touch attack. So uh, a roll with advantage. Come on. Oh. Yeah, twenty three hits. Excellent on the hit, but I was hoping for a crit. That's <laughs> a lot. Just 
slides behind her and uppercuts into the spine. All right, yeah, you do that, and she's like, ah! All right, starting to see why Claire got fucked by you guys. <laughs> is that your turn? Yes, that is Dusk's. Okay, Pappy. Uh, Pappy is going to go ahead and, uh, I measured this out, slide into this position, scooting underneath the legs of uh, good old Boulder here. Bonus action, spare the dying on Gabo. Okay, and... Gabo no longer needs to make uh, saves. Alright, and then uh, blah, 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 the... It finally got a use. Yay. Uh, gonna go ahead and... Uh, fuck it, I'm not gonna have the opportunity to use this otherwise. Uh, do I not have my channel divinity? Do I have it mapped out correctly? Uh, nope. Cool. Uh, so, gonna go ahead and use the Grave Cleric Domain Path to the Grave. Uh, as an action, you choose one creature you can see within 60 feet of you, cursing it until the end of your next turn. Next time you or an ally hits the cursed creature with an attack, the creature has vulnerability to all of that attack's damage, then the curse ends. Vulnerability doubles the damage of the attack. Okay. Pretty so. That's, uh... No safe. And j just fuck her on the, the next attack that hits her, as an action. That's quite a lot to take in. Okay. Took me a second to find Cursed. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. And uh, that is the turn. I did all of it and uh, had a useful bonus action. All right. So, uh, top of uh, Goblin's turn. The, yep. Should be uh, <laughs> <laughs> yep. He's uh, um, live. All right, so top of the round, from this side of the room, which looks to be covered in, I think that, that, that's water? Yeah, that's water. But coming out of the murk, from, uh, from, uh, from what seems to be the flooded tunnels of the mines, is a skeleton. He's got a bow in one hand and a sword in the other. And he looks at the four of you and says, WHY MUST YOU FAIL ME SO OFTEN?! <laughs> he, fails. <laughs> he fails his own self. Unfortunately, it's the top of the round, so it's actually this guy's turn. Oh, there he is. Guy on the uh, top of the cage. Hang on. I, I think they're just out of my... I, I forgot to shimmy it. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Here. What about your spirit guardian? Yeah, it... What, where are you I not? think it's out of range. It, it is, but also it's... Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah it is why just out of range. Alright, yeah, he's gonna take a step back just to avoid that as best he can, and um, he's hey. also gonna take a... Gotta take a short bow attack at you, the little guy, because you seem to be the most useful party member at the moment. His attack is, of course, with disadvantage. Does a 20 hit you? He does hit. Okay. So you will take five points of piercing damage. And I get to make a save versus 10 for concentration. Yes, you do. Okay. Yep, I your think spells that's are still safe. up. Alright, Gucci. Uh, right. Cork! Oh, I forgot to Okay! Um... If you're gonna hit her, hit her with something big. She's vulnerable to the next damage. Oh, well, guess what? Guess what I have? I have something called... Action Surge! So I get an extra action! It's only on the first that. attack, by the way. Okay. So, so I have two. You can so use I have two an attack action. Action. That's you, can, yeah, you can still have the two attack. Well, you have your two attacks anyway, but you need to use an action to switch to your sword. 
So you would get make guys level four or something. Oh, I was gonna use my bow. I was just gonna use the bow I have equipped. Uh, just don't be too close. Though. Okay. I should have made you guys level four or something. This is ridiculous. <laughs> hey, it's your okay, fault. So, and since I'm using action surge, which I'm pretty sure counts as a bonus action. No, it's a special nope. action. Uh, action so. surge doesn't cost anything because it gives you a net positive. Okay, yeah. so um, longbow number uno. Number uno. That does not hit. Nope. Dos. Nope. Another two, and the third one. That definitely hits. It does hit. Okay, go ahead and roll damage. And Not bad. Oh, shit. And that's uh, that was the hag. That was the hag. Okay, right. so... That one is doubled to 18. Wait, really? Yes. It is vul shit. She is vulnerable to the first damage that he hits her. 18 points okay. of damage. Okay, thank you for explaining that. Okay, yeah. I yeah. wish the other two attacks hit, but whatever. Okay, yeah, you it let... Hold on one second, this music's really loud. Is it, is it, no, this isn't the runescape. Okay. Anyway, yeah, you let loose two arrows that don't connect, but the third one, she's like, Ha ha ha, you missed! And then the third one goes right in her eye. She no longer has depth perception. Does that mean she has disadvantage? Uh, no, she, she's just missing an eye. Is that your turn? Uh, I don't have anything else I can do. No, no, I have like second wind which could heal me, but I don't really need healing right now, so no, I, I'm done. Okay, it is the hag's turn. Uh, she starts inside of my radius, therefore she must make the save. Uh, what is the DC on that? Uh, I'm pulling it up real quick. Also, and, is it wisdom? Uh, I think so. Yep, wisdom DC 14. Okay. Save verse half. Unfortunately, she does not save. So she takes a full 15 whammage. 15 points of damage! Oof! Yeah, she is... Ooh, she is hanging by a thread and she knows it! Uh, which is why she goes ahead and casts... Where is it? Where is it? Invisible Passage to completely disappear from you guys. And she's somewhere in this room. Right, that was her turn. Uh, Boulder. You know what? I feel like you got the, this one, Pappy. And Boulder's going to move over to where the cage is. He wants to climb on top to fucking wreck this asshole. As you climb on top of the cage, he, he's kind of nervously pointing his bow at you. He's like, fucking don't kill me. No, you you made your bed. You lie in it. There's my thing I'm gonna do. Okay, so Steve, what did I have wrong? It's a plus what? What do I have wrong? So you... I have my plus five. Yeah, yeah for... For your attack roll, you are only adding strength as if you were not proficient with the weapon. Uh, I, I don't know why that is. So you should be rolling with a plus eight. Yeah, so it'd be yeah, that'd be twenty-three. 23. Uh, yeah, that that hits sure. And then it's uh, the was it not? plus seven for my damage yes. rate? D twelve yeah. plus seven. I was typing in this time since it's being a bitch about letting me do it. Nine. Uh, yeah. He shatters into a million little tiny bones as the axe comes in and just, just completely obliterates him. 
pit bits falling off the cage here and there. He's gone. Did it. Right. Clap. Good job, Boulder. Is that your turn? There you go. Wait, how? I was right here. That took me 20 feet. So... I can move 45, so I can come right back down. Just near. And this skeleton wants a piece of fucking shit. I'm going towards him. He's looking at you too. I'm gonna get you, some bitch. Yes. No. <laughs> My turn has ended. Okay. Uh, dusk. Biggest boy. He's bigger than the rest of us. Dusk? And he's a magic man. Yeah. Oh shit. You said it was Dusk's turn. Yeah. yeah. I... He's bigger than he's bigger than me and uh me uh, and Mark. So uh I specifically did not cast the other spell I was planning on casting because I wanted to have a spare spell slot for this clutch spell. See invisibility. Okay. Dusk, uh, uh, Dusk pulls it from a pouch some silver powder, rubs it across the eyes, and casts see invisibility, and can now see all invisible creatures. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sure enough, uh, you spot her kind of poking her head out over here. Uh, yeah, Dusk is gonna go right ahead and actually flank around and, uh, try to intercede. Walks over and just looks with silver eyes with the powder starting to coagulate and run down the face. Okay. Anything else? And, uh, well, that was their action, so, uh, yes. That is that is their turn. They are looking directly down at this hag. In her mind, she's just like, he can't see me, right? No. No, no. I'm good. Dusk is staring directly into her eyes. No. No. I rule. I kick ass. He doesn't see me. It's these guys. They fucking suck. Yeah. I'm good. Good. All right. Uh, uh, Pappy, up you're up. <laughs> uh, Pappy is going to do the Pappy thing of, uh, well, actually, I have, I should have, uh, nope, never mind. I thought I had uh, <laughs> healing word, but I specifically did not take healing word because uh, it is not as good, but. Uh, Pappy is gonna walk down over to uh walk over to Dusk and be like, Hey uh, what you see in there, bud? And uh also cast Spare the Dying on Dusk. Okay. You do so. Alright, that's their turn. Um doesn't she need to make a save, though? Yeah, what well, is the save? Uh, well, uh, well, she makes a save on her turn. Uh, okay. Right! So. Uh, it's the goblin's turn. Riveting. It's the skeleton's <laughs> turn. Lamau. <laughs> Come at me, bitch! Alright, so the first thing you notice about this skeleton is he fucking bolts! <laughs> He is fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> and he runs right up behind Pappy here, and he's gonna take a swing at you. I said, for not guessing! Does a 15 hit? Nope, 17 armor class. Extra or 18 attack. armor class. Oh, same as me. 18. <laughs> oh, that's a nick. Okay. Uh, also, the first time that they enter the radius... So you take uh, three points of damage. 
Uh, I forgot. Uh, the first time they enter the radius on uh, on their turn, specifically, uh, that is when they get hit if they willingly entered it. All right. So yeah, uh, yeah. Before he hits me, he takes uh, eleven radiant damage. Eleven radiant damage. All right. Yeah, he's not Big really boy. phased by it. He's still up. <laughs> All right. Uh, so Pappy then needs to make a constitution save. Yep. Uh, come on, above a ten. Hell yeah. Right, yep, you maintain your spells. Alright, and I took four damage. Alright, awesome. Uh, yep. Pappy takes the sword to the back. Bitch! Okay, so that was... Worst fucking comedian ever. That was from here to here. Oh, yeah. Not bad. Uh, and then he's gonna go from here, there, there. Attack of opportunity from Pappy. Uh, yeah. Pappy will go ahead and deck him. Is it 20 hit? 20 does hit. Go ahead and roll damage. <laughs> it's punching time. Okay, eight so damage. Eight points damage. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, you go ahead. You take a swing at him. He, he, he's like, ah! Gets right here. He turns around. He's like, you dick! And then he keeps going. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, like, bitch. It's like haymaker to the back of the head. He's running towards you, Cork. Uh, that is his turn. Okay, okay, top of the round. Dead skeleton and Cork. You're up, actually. Well, uh, since I can I attack the skeleton since it's diagonal. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna switch my sword then. Yeah, okay, you don't need to move anywhere. He's right there. Okay. Roll for. I don't. I think the action surge only hits for one, only is used for one round, so I don't have it. Yeah, I don't have it. So okay, let's just break the track. So you're golden. Normal. That 19, hits, I'm gonna uh, Let me check, actually. <laughs> yeah, that hits. Go ahead, roll damage. Okay. Normal. No, that's not correct. Correct would be nine. There would be a 19 on the die itself. Okay, that's so you do 10 damage. points of damage to Mr. Skeleton, and he's like, ah! Next Fuck attack you. roll. Let's what is what my this favorite stack? 14 does not hit. Okay. Alright, so you. Take that first swing, it kind of kind of pierces into his armor a little bit, which he is wearing. Like, plate armor. You don't know where he got it, but it, it's kind of got some... Kind of got some algae and shit on it. Like, it looks like he fished this out of the water. But plate mail is plate mail, and it is... It is working, because the second strike kind of bounces off the plate and does not... Do any damage. All right. So is that your is that your turn? That would be my turn. Yes. All right. right fantastic. Hack turn. Uh, she has she to make, to make a save, save, if I recall. A correct roundo. All right. So that's a wisdom save. Wah, Again. Wah, oof. Sucks to be her. Ah, that's mediocre. Eight. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, she needs to make that con save. Uh, constitution save. Oh, damn. No, she succeeds. Uh, yeah. yeah, no. Her invisibility goes down. Wait, what? How do you want to do this? <laughs> oh, she, oh, she ran out of HP. <laughs> <laughs> she, was so, a, she was at seven. You rolled an eight. Uh, so, as... It, like, Dusk is just looking down. Pappy turns and punches the skeleton, and all of the uh, various candies and little golems, they just conglomerate, and no one has been noticing that they've been stacking together into a big red and white peppermint golem. And it just also stares right at her, puts the hands together, and just 
slams down on the skull of the hag. Okay. Yeah, that happens, and, uh, in her dying breath, she's like, What a world! What a world! Well, I had a good run. Fuck you guys. <laughs> she becomes a literal, just, mush. Just a viscera on the floor. Go, Peppermint! I don't have a token for peppermint. <laughs> uh, no, they, it disappears after that because there's just the uh, good old radius. Yep. Alright. <laughs> and now one skeleton remains. So is that your turn? Bearing the gun. Uh, that was her turn. Oh. Yeah, that was her turn. <laughs> Fucking die. It was. <laughs> What an interesting turn! Boulder. <laughs> Me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Alright, that's it. We're flanking. I'm over your bullshit, Mr. Man. <laughs> uh, Boulder, as you approach the skeleton, uh, you notice that the lower jaw is a slightly different shade of white than the rest of the skull. Almost like he grabbed this lower jaw what? from a completely different skeleton. No, we're not answering your riddle. What is my or favorite joke? snack? You had your chance and you failed it miserably. Is it, How do you do the... What is it? Advantage roll? Because I need to type it with the... Proper name. Um, uh, there would be an advantage button. button when you hit attack. Yeah, there's an advantage. Well, no, button. because it's not giving the proper plus on it. It's doing oh. a plus five when it's supposed to. Uh, be uh, wait. We could try our new calculator for this. Okay, do you see the um, thing down the bottom, right? Yeah. There, the, there's a the situational zero? bonus. You see the oh, zero yeah. there, right? Yeah, I see. Put in your eight. plus, then uh, oh, yeah. whatever die you're rolling, and hit roll. Let's see if it works. But I need to be. Where's? Oh, there's advantage. Okay. Work. Yeah. Seventeen does not hit. <laughs> you motherfucker. We're gonna do that again, you bitch boy. You try to cleave into his arm and it and he like repels it. Almost like a perfect parry. God fucking Fourteen does not hit. He does the same thing again with the <laughs> other arm. He's got his arms up, and he's like, Nah! Well, I tried. <laughs> no, I'm not fucking guessing. I'm gonna rip that jaw off, too. <laughs> Alright, um... Alright, he hears this, and he reaches behind him and puts on, like, a helmet. He, at this point, looks like the fucking skeleton when you log into old-school RuneScape. It does He's not so give him any armor bonuses. Is that your turn? You don't even need it. Uh, Alright, is that your turn? Well, yeah, like I said, I can't do anything else. Alright, Dusk, you're up. Poppy is on deck. Dusk! <laughs> oh, fuck. Why do I keep forgetting Dusk isn't on... <laughs> I keep Dusk, forgetting what is Dusk my favorite isn't... snack? You wonder how he started calling you guys by name. The hearing us shouting it. I'm coming for you too, Pappy! Steven! <laughs> He's breaking the fourth wall. Like, Stop him! Bad. <laughs> and, uh. Oh man, I am basically out of spells. Uh. Yeah, let's go ahead and, uh... Oh, that's also necrotic. You know what? Let, let, let's give him... Give this fellow the one-two special. Uh, so, I'm gonna make two unarmed attacks, and, uh... We, you don't have lightning from this angle. Uh... I mean, can I get into an angle that I have flanking? Uh... I don't think so, no. I'm gonna say yeah, no yeah, because this. Must. I'm gonna say no because this might be funny. Fifteen does not hit. All right. Why did I click that? Whatever. 
21 does <gasps> hit, however. Oh, damn. Go ahead, roll damage. Oh, the dusk. Okay, so five. he will take five points of damage. All right, so that first one, you go ahead, you punch him. You punch him again a couple times. Standing here, you realize... He's oh, my just God. <laughs> And then before I could finish that joke, one hit does land right in the head, and that does do five points of damage. <laughs> he turns to you and he's like, you dick! <laughs> Dusk just stares. Alright, Pappy's turn. Alright, Pappy is, uh, first of all, going to, uh, get into flanking position and bring this with him. Oh boy. <laughs> His turn's and... next. Oh yeah! <laughs> and, uh, gonna go ahead and... Ah, oh, damn. Go the one too, Poppy. You can do it. Uh, gonna go ahead and re-bless the party here. Okay. Uh, this, wait, okay. nope, scratch that. Not doing that. That's a concentration. Okay. Uh, uh, then, uh, I guess, fuck it, let's one-two punch. Okay, make that attack. Everyone's just going to team up and I am flanking now. <laughs> uh, does a 26 hit? Uh, I don't know, let me check. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, seven uh, more points of damage. <laughs> Alright, and oh, offhand. <laughs> yep. Uh, <20 laughs> yep. Alright, excellent. Roll some more damage. Okay, six points of damage. Uh, yeah, that okay. armor's starting to look pretty dented there. <laughs> Can't be too Grand comfortable plate, under man. these. <sighs> Punching plate what? mail, bloody it's just a container of broken bones now. Yeah. <laughs> right, is that it? Oh uh, yeah, that's uh because it's bonus action offhand, so. Wait, do you, is... you have to do? I oh, know you already did the concentration save. That's right. Uh, yeah. no, there's none required. There's, anyway. Yeah, he, he doesn't need to. Nothing like hit him or anything. Oh, uh, yeah. Not, right, never mind. Stays unless he's Not like, yet. Yeah. Alright. Uh, is that your turn? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, unconscious Goblin. How they doing? Uh, still <laughs> unconscious. Uh, yes, still out. Right. Now it's his turn. Uh, wisdom save? Correct a window. Wisdom saving throw. No. No. All right, let's not, not quite. Uh, okay, but... Mhm, mm mhm. Mm okay. Radiant damage. Right, uh, he's still hanging on. <laughs> uh, he's gonna turn to you, Pappy, actually. Uh, and he is gonna short sword his way into your chest cavity. <laughs> you can fucking try. I will! Does a 13 hit you? No, that just taps the armor. <laughs> uh, how about a 15? Nope, oh. 18 armor glass. <laughs> yeah, you and me have 18. I also have 18 with my shield. <laughs> everyone, he starts everyone. furiously slamming on your armor, and at, the, and it's at this point he yells, RIBS! SPARE RIBS! FUCK! But he did say ribs, you son of a bitch! He did not say spare ribs! Alright, and he is gonna... That's a lot of invoking of attack of opportunities! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, everyone's gonna be attacking him! Fuck is it. He, gonna... he bolts. <laughs> Four attacks oh. of opportunity. Do they have advantage? They're all flanking still? No. Oh yeah! Wait, do we still have advantage? I must say no. Alright. Okay. I'll let you uh, go. You? That is not it. Uh, nope. Nope. Me. Two, three. 
Oh wait, no, mine is incorrect. Nope. He might actually get out of this. <laughs> That's a neck. Yep, it's not <laughs> he also has 18 over class. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is 18 over class. Is Dusk 18? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Make sure I put this in mm. right. It's 1d12 plus 7. Then it'll be halved. Uh, seven. Halved so to 7. Minus 7. Oosh. He's, he, he's not looking good. <laughs> uh, but he's hanging in there. Um, getting a little close to that goblin. Oh no, you know. Oh no. That's his turn. All right, well, top of the round. Well, guess what? I have a bow, so that's what I'm switching to. Okay, top of the round. Uh, dead skeleton. He's still dead. Cork, you're up. Okay, I think I've... I mean, you know what's up? I think I... Okay, so I think I'm at... Oh, 16 yeah. arrows, maybe 15. So I still have arrows. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna aim I'm gonna aim my bow at the skeleton. Uh that's the fire thing. Okay. Where's the skeleton? You, you aim bow. your bow, do you fire the bow? <laughs> yes. Attack roll normal. That does not that's hit. A mess. Uh Next why is wall. boulder on fire. For that I was just I was just putting that on. I am resistant to fire damage. That definitely yeah. doesn't hit either. So, okay. Yep. Uh, yeah, he's too fast for you. He's do he's Neil from the Matrix, dodging these fucking arrows. <laughs> Which is weird because he's wearing full plate. Yeah, somehow, magically. Uh, okay, I don't know who else's turn it is. Any anything else on your turn? I can't move, so no. Okay, Boulder. You son of a bitch! Is that Very, 30 feet? I move 45. Okay, so yeah, you can close that distance. I get over there. <laughs> no, you fucking don't, you son of a bitch! Oh, yeah, that's rage! This. That's what the fire symbol is. It's rage! Oh, no, it's yeah, burning. Yeah, you got this. Oh. It's burning. Uh, I just put it there because my rage has... I'm desert, so I could set something on fire if I want to at any time, and I'm oh. resistant to fire damage. I don't think there is okay. a rage. Anyway, Boulder, what are you doing? I'm fucking swinging this bitch. Okay. One sec, my thingy's a fucking dirt. There we go. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yes. <laughs> that hits. Go ahead, roll damage. Eight. This motherfucker dead yet. Hunter? How do you want to do this? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I want to literally just, when I swing, I'm just going to be like, your joke sucks so hard. And as I slam into him with my fucking great axe, I'm going to like, when it hits him, basically pick him up with it and launch him. Like just bashing him into the nearest object. For the sake just of fun, where are you launching him specifically? Like, with my swing, it's gonna be, like, into here. Okay. I, I've actually got a funnier idea, but I don't have my sword equipped. I would say throw it to me, and I'll hit it like a baseball. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have my sword equipped, so I can't do that. <laughs> Maybe someone can punch the skeleton. If this is a solid, like, like any solid surface, just bam. Okay, so yeah, you cleave right into him, and as as the axe hits, he's still like, "No, you suck!" 
it gets cut off and just gets chucked into the pile of bodies over here. And he, fi- and he finally kind of twitches a little bit and then clatters to the ground. He's finally dead. I think we've done it. I think. I hope. Uh, so... Uh, yeah, with all of the enemies, hopefully, deceased, uh, Pappy is going to drop the, I'm gonna go ahead and drop Spirit Guardians, uh, so that it doesn't I... accidentally kill the goblin. I guess and... I'll also search for my arrows, can I do that? I think it's an investigator check. I mean, yeah, you can, but uh, before that happens, you hear a voice coming from this cage. Is it over? Yes. I'm pretty sure it's over. Could, or, could you let me out? Sure. Which cage is he in? It, or her? It is in this cage. Okay, strength check away. That would be an ability check. Oh, what does sure. a 16 do? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, you uh, you managed to get the door rip it right on open. <laughs> Thank yeah, you. Are you oh, the mother it's... of the little girl? Hmm. Are you the mother of the little girl that we found? Angie, you found her? Yes, she was at the start of she was at the start of this building. Oh, thank the gods, where is she? Uh, she should She's be just outside. outside hanging out with yeah. an orange cat. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. It, it just thank you. And she promptly exits the room. Just pretend she's Yeah, get out of here. I don't actually it have should a be token. Clear. Okay, so what okay. is the rest of the group you know, doing? Well, I already said I was going to search for my arrows, so yeah. investigative check away. No, you could just go find them. Oh. Never mind, not with that roll, you can't. You managed to find one of them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you rolled. Too bad. <laughs> we can buy you more. Uh, so, uh, Pappy is going to go go ahead and, uh, with this unconscious gabo. Uh, gonna go ahead and use Cure Wounds at first level, but because they are Grave Domain Cleric, they have their Circle of Mortality. At first level, you gain the ability to blah 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 blah. When you normally roll one or more dice to restore hit points to a creature who has zero hit points, you instead use the highest number possible for each die. So, it is automatically an 8 plus my spellcasting modifier, which uh, I'm just going to roll. Okay, yeah, don't even roll. Oh, I rolled max. He's Uh, 11. Doesn't matter. Guy had 7 hit points, and he comes back to consciousness. Very suddenly, he's like, (gasps) Who are you? Hello there. Who are you? Well, we found you controlled by a hag, and I may have shot you with an arrow. My bad. Big fucking heroes, that's what we are. By the gods. Guild members, at last. Okay, listen. There's some real fucked up shit going on down here. There's a coven We already killed the hags. What? Yep, the hags are gone. They're dead? Yep. All all three of them. You killed all three? Yeah, you were with the last one. And she's over there and points at the pile of mush. Oh, Oh, good gods. What did you do to her? Uh, candy golem. The candy golem showed showed her the clap of life. What's a candy golem? By that I mean death. The golem made of candy. Its name is peppermint. That sounds dumb. You're dumb. No, I'm sorry. Saved your ass. Not that I'm ungrateful, of course. When we get back to the guild, we will make sure your efforts are commended. We appreciate that, because that's where we're trying to go. But then we happened upon this place where apparently many adventurers have died. You haven't happened to find my cart, have you? It's made of mahogany. Oh, 
Oh yeah, definitely, it's out there. I'm going to... That means I can probably we, we were, get my we, deposit back. Maybe? Probably. We were thinking we'd all take it, and we'd all go back. Good, good. Sounds good. Shall we get yeah. going, then? The townspeople will yep. probably have questions as to what's going on. I mean, they were high as a kite they, before they, they we were, did They were very hexed. Like, yeah. all the, like, these hags were making pastries that are hexed and made of people. Like, I don't know how long they're going to be hexed for. Ah, a code green, was it? Sure. Uh, I see. Boulder's too stupid. He doesn't know. He doesn't remember. Uh, taking a quick flip through your Adventure Guild handbook, uh, you, um look up that a code green is a cannibalistic type situation oh yeah like yeah, Boulder doesn't know sense. he usually just looks to like any of the other three for information usually looks at Dusk because Dusk is very smart you're not the brightest tool in, you're not the brightest one in the shed are you oh no I'm just beefy I'm meathead man I'm not smart I nice. just smash shit that's my job. I don't... I, my job isn't thinking. My job is smash. Right. Well, as, as much as I'm enjoying this conversation, we should probably get moving. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I think we should get out of this Let's corpsey cave. I don't want to hear any more fucking skeleton jokes. That too. I want to leave. <laughs> okay. So... Yeah, we will take our leave. You are all gonna head back out? Yep, we yeah. are leaving. Okay. You head back to the surface. You explain to everyone what the hell just happened. And from the looks of it, with the death of all three hags, it seems that the hexes have been lifted. There's a lot of confusion going around. A lot of people wondering, what day is it? It is Wednesday, my dudes. It is, my dude. Frog think, goes by. I think it's Tuesday. <laughs> you see that orange cat again, and he says, Mondays, am I right? Every day is a Monday for you. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I imagine we hosted a bit of, like, a, everybody's confused, but then being like, okay, everybody gather around, because I... Don't, it didn't look like it was a lot of people, and then just explaining it en masse to everybody, like we are of the Adventures Guild, we have rescued you from uh, three hag, uh, hag coven, so there were three hags that were hexing you all. Just doing the whole explanation of this is what happened, but everything's okay now and safe. You see the bartender there, and he's like, Alright, who's gonna call the cleaners? <laughs> Right, yeah, maybe. by the way, I wouldn't re I wouldn't recommend going uh, underneath the uh, windmill. Just don't. Well, that's why we're calling Yeah, the... yeah, don't. Well, that's why it's we're calling bad. the cleaners. Adventures if the don't cleaners stick can around manage and... to move that many dead bodies, I don't even want to begin to tell you how many bodies are in there. Uh, so, it's common knowledge within the Adventure Guild that the cleaners are the group that come in and clean up after the adventure. They're the Viscera cleanup detail. You don't know how they do it, but they, they are very good at what they do. They just, they probably, it's just a bunch of casters, and they banish them to another plane. Like just sending <laughs> all of, the, sending all of the bodies and viscera into another plane of existence. Like, nope. Send this shit out. Garbage shoot. Whoop. Exactly, Bob. All right. Was there anything else you folks want to do in town? Well... I say we should pissed. party. We saved the town after all. What what better way to celebrate um, saving lives than to have a party? Yeah, you need you need some rest. You need some rest, our go our goblin comrade. Maybe maybe we all take a breather, have a little bit a little bit of a celebration, and then we go back tomorrow. I'm actually quite oh. fine, but if you folks want to rest, it's been a day. We went through that whole place. 
I'm we killed sure. three hags today and too I'm, many other things. I'm pretty sure everyone wants to get drunk because let's face it, it's been one heck of a day. It's been a heck of a day. Woo! You notice there's a few people wondering what year is it. Oh. What year is oh. it? Oh. I mean, we would know what year it is. I would assume. <laughs> it's, uh, Pappy. What year is it? Uh, I'm not keeping track. Like. 872. It's around 872. One to three, give or take. I don't know. I've been gone for a while. I, I I used to keep my books, and that's how I had it. You know, I had my habit. But now I'm here adventuring again. And uh, you know, let's just let's just take the medium and say uh, eight seventy two. This sounds about right. What do you mean it's eight seventy two? That's the year. That should yep, be fifty years true. from now. Uh, no wonder you look like an old fuck. Yeah, you know what? That explains a lot. Guess that you're gonna be uh, needing a place to stay. Uh, no, yeah, we're we taking all these cots and leaving them. I can't allow that. <laughs> Excuse you, we just saved your entire fucking town. Come on. Give Happy us a cracks break. his knuckles. We're, we're exhausted. <laughs> I think you can handle giving us one day, like, one night of respite before we have to, like, go on our way after we save the whole town. One right, silver. Gang. One silver. Per bed. Are you fucking kidding me? Look, we gotta rebuild our money somehow. We just spent all of it on cakes. I thought you were making money just fine. Wait, weren't the cakes made out of people? Yes. Yes, but they still bought them. Yes. But hey, hey they were, he was still making money. But fine. You can have some silver if you're going to be a rude dude. I guess I'll just have just off. or something. Yeah, yeah, bud. Here's your fucking silver. Uh, thank you kindly. Then just gonna spend the night just vibing. Cork has no silver. I didn't give him any money, so that's, that's was... okay. I, I gave him some. I money. gotcha, buds. Was... Don't you worry about it. But drinks are on the bartender. Yeah, okay. buddy. So, was there anything else? Nope, just drinking with the homies and then passing out before yeah. we go to the Adventurers Guild tomorrow. Hell yeah. You party all night, or? At least to the extent that you can party in an establishment such as this Before inn, I'm like, I'm which is tired. not that great. Beds aren't that great either, but they're passable. It's okay. Good enough. And the next day, you all gather into the wagon. They do give you a horse. Uh, Pappy, they are going to let you keep that money box that you got from the bakery. Nice. I don't think Pappy would let it go. And you all head off down the road. New horizons, new adventures. But before you go, you do notice the fog seems a little clearer in Kellingville. We did it! And that is the end, ladies and gentlemen. But we did it! We scourged the plague upon this foggy town. We literally made it right, right in time. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Thank you all. And we saved the kids! Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you folks had fun. I know we did. We'll see you guys soon for Conversation Castle. Yeah. And yeah. We'll see you guys for campaign two. <laughs>